Hello guys, welcome to my video series tutorial to talk about Microsoft Simatic Kernel. In this video, I am going to focus on Kernel Streaming API function. Let's start. This is our previous sample which we used in a prompt YAML config. So the same I copied for streaming demo also. Here I run the application. Here we send message Chennai. Once I send this message, so actually in the background is processing our request, but in the EA there is no information, just cursor is blinking. Finally, we get a result in a flash. So the flash, the second the result is getting displayed. Instead of that, we print word by word so that we can engage with the customer still your request has been processing. So how to implement this feature? First, I stop this application. Here we calling this invoke async. So no need to call this function. I remove this code. Instead of that, wait for each where result result in kernel builder dot this time we have to use invoke steaming async function invoke steaming async the plugin name or kernel function is a yaml function here the second argument is our input so that is a kernel arguments kernel arguments. That's it. Close and we print the result. Console.write result. That's it. We run the application and see the result. City name Chennai. Here the result is getting printing better than our previous output, but still somehow it's lagging. It's not like typing message kind of thing. It's printing like you know two or three characters at a time, something like this. So if you want to change this word by word, you have to do after printing this console result, you can just make one sleep. For example, 100 milliseconds sleep. That's it. Restart the application. This time we'll send message Chennai. So now you can see it's printing character by character, something like this. So this way you can engage with the customer, your request has been processing like this. I hope you can understand how to implement invoke steaming concept in Symmetric Kernel. Thanks to all.